The Adventures of Gary and Harry, A Tale of Two Turtles, written by Lisa Matsumoto, illustrated by Michael Faria. Deep in the sparkling sea, Gary the green sea turtle and his best friend Harry the hawksbill turtle played in their ocean home. Each day they would swim to the surface and happily dive beneath the waves. Gary and Harry loved their carefree life in the sea and liked to visit their many ocean friends like Olivia the octopus, Lori the lobster, and even Herman the grumpy old hermit crab, who was really nothing but a big softy under that crusty old shell. For Gary and Harry, each day was a great underwater adventure. Some days, they would explore deep into the dark underwater caverns. Other days, they would search for long lost treasures buried deep in the hulls of old sunken ships. When they wanted a good laugh, they would visit the crazy clownfishes who performed in Harrow Harlequin Shrimp's Spectacular Sea Circus. One day after their morning adventure, Gary and Harry were especially hungry. As always, it was difficult deciding what to have for lunch since they had very different tastes in food. How about a salty seaweed salad made of fresh algae, Gary suggested. Algae? Yuck! Harry replied making a face. I'd rather have a nice tasty jellyfish. His wish had been answered, for suddenly, a school of jellyfish floated by. Wow! Look at all those jellyfish! Harry quickly swam to the largest one and swallowed it in. One big gulp! Gary expected to hear a satisfied, ah! But instead, Harry responded with a terrified, Ack! Harry was gasping and choking. That was no jellyfish he had swallowed. It was a plastic bag. Harry knew many sea turtles had died from choking on plastic bags, but he never once thought it would happen to him. Harry desperately tried everything to remove the plastic bag, but it just wouldn't come out. His life flashed before him. Luckily, Gary had just completed his turtle safety class, and by using the Heimlich maneuver, the plastic bag flew right from Harry's throat. Phew! That was close, Harry said while catching his breath. How did a plastic bag get in the ocean anyway? How else, Gary answered. The humans. Well, they need to be more careful to keep their trash out of our homes, Harry said angrily. Gary couldn't agree with him more. Suddenly, Harry's stomach rumbled. All the excitement worked up his appetite. Well, I'm starving, he told Gary. Let's get lunch. Just then, a beautiful jellyfish floated by. Look, Harry, just what you asked for. Lunch! After what Harry had been through, suddenly, jellyfish didn't seem very appealing. Maybe I'll try one of those salty seaweed salads. Gary's face quickly lit up. Well, I know the perfect place to go, he said excitedly. And with a flick of their flippers, they quickly dove through the crystal blue water, eager to enjoy a nice, delicious, relaxing lunch. The end.